Howdy folks, my name's Jay. This Woodmill CNC Technologies machine belongs to a custom cabinet shop. They purchased this machine to cut the parts for their cabinets, but they quickly realized that their possibilities are endless. Since owning this machine, they've been cutting composite panels, solid surface countertops, acrylics, high density polymers. Uh, today I want to show you how easy it is to cut the parts for a decorative kitchen exhaust hood. Okay, this is what we're going to build today. This is a radius wood hood for an exhaust fan insert. Uh, the architect has done a really good job of giving us dimensions and showing the radius. So we're going to simply pull this into VCAR Pro to create the parts that we need to, to frame this hood up. Okay, folks, here we go. We are in VCAR Pro. We are going to start off on the left by setting up our materials. We're going to use a 4x8 sheet of plywood, so the width is 48 inches. The height is 96 inches, and the thickness is 3 quarters of an inch, so 0.75. We're going to say OK. Now, I've imported this DXF file. This is the part that we're going to cut. This is going to be one of the rafters uh, to build this, this radius hood. So I'm going to select that part and go to nesting. And we're going to say we want 10 of these. So we'll, we'll do 10, apply, and preview. Okay, there we go. Notice it'll, it'll optimize. It'll rotate, uh, turn 90 degrees. It'll, it'll fit as many parts as possible on a sheet of plywood so you have little waste. So we're going to say OK. Now we're going to select all of these parts and move to the right-hand side of the screen, set up our tool pass. So we are going to cut these parts out. So we will select our 3 8. So first of all, the thickness. Notice again, it's 0.765. We want to cut through the material. So the, the thickness is 0.765. We're going to use our 3 8 compression bit, and we're going to make one pass. OK, let's calculate. There it is. It's, it's telling us you're cutting through the material into the spoil board, and that's OK. Preview, and there it is. There's the parts that we'll be cutting out. So we're going to come back here, and we are going to save this toolpath. Let's select select the toolpath, and then save it. Now it's going to create a tap file. So we'll save this tap file onto a thumb drive, and let's go out in the shop, and let's cut these up on the Woodmill CNC Technologies machine. There you go, folks. Parts cut with extreme accuracy on the Woodmill CNC Technologies machine. I appreciate you watching this video. If you want to see more videos, subscribe to our YouTube channel. And as usual, you can always email me direct at jay at woodmillcnctechnologies.com. Thanks.